<laughs> Link told me to did, summon him. What I the f- not, freak? I did not summon anyone. Wait. What's going on? I encountered another Pokemon that was right far in front of me. Oh. What? You. Oh, I'm what? now in a cutscene. Okay, that's strange. How the hell did you, like, segue, like, to the left towards that Pokemon? Like, no, you that's because you, you have to jump that. away in order to have enough space to send your Pokemon out. That, no, but that I always happens. It didn't. He literally gravitated towards the Pokemon while he it didn't. Was... Well, it's I don't know what to say alive. because I'm in a cutscene. You'll see it, Sean. You'll see oh, it. Oh, this this game is just so well built. Ah. Was it was it me or you that did Clive? Uh, I do Clive because he's like Mr. Elegant from Spy Family. Ah, oh, most yeah. elegant. Sure, like a panda man. Operation Staff was going well, wouldn't you say? Only two bosses left now. This whole experience has been eye opening, to say the least. I'm glad I could take part. Have never done anything. Oh, the road codes. But I'm curious. What do you think of Cassiopeia? Cassiopeia. They're a bag of riddles. <laughs> yeah. Is that so? Personally, I don't think Cassiopeia feels any hate or resentment towards Team Star. No, there must be some other reason behind Star uh, Operation Starfall. And it must not be that Squad elegant. Up. Squad up. So who could it be? <laughs> Squad up. Hang on, I must squad up. Squad I was going to say, did you not like, yeah. do that whilst that sound was going off, right? No, because I was in the middle of talking? Reading dialogue? Yeah. Didn't really have I a always, chance. I always stop talking whenever a sound alert goes off. Oh, I was in the middle. I wasn't going to pause and then get thrown off. For if you groove. Rude. Well, I'd basically be back to keeping watch. Call for me if you decide to take on the base, okay? Well, a duh. most elegant solution, dear boy. They don't what even help her? us take on. What her old chap? There was a lady in a kimono around here. I think we completely skipped her because we got... We... Uh, or was well, it for the Clive best. in the distance? Hey, no, Sean. it was this lady. We got, pu we got pushed like halfway down the bloody mountain. Hey, Sean. What? You bastard. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Slayer's talking to Mama Panda in chat. I'm literally at the front to do it now. I'm fighting this lady, because I was heading toward her and then the game skipped her. Fight me, you strange woman! Oh, I got the tail. Ooh. Wait, this is the fairy base, isn't it? It's a good thing that I learned poison, Jack. Isn't it a dark fairy? Well, I was talking about the base behind, not this actual pub. Ba what do you mean by base behind? Do you not see the massive base behind the Pokemon that I'm fighting right now? Which is where oh, we were going in the towards. Distance. Oh god. Uh, Wait, I, I don't see how that was missing. That half the screen is covered by that. I'm not really. Pa I'm paying half attention to the game, Sean. Well, oh, like. I did point it out multiple times. I mean, come on. Ooh, I, I can splash it. Splash I'm not sure, not sure if anyone else is paying attention other than you and Panda, really. Rude. You'd have thought the viewers were. That's what we're here for. <laughs> I mean, other mods, so. What? What? <laughs> You should be paying more attention than anyone. I don't really know Pokemon. I don't even know this game. But you know, know what a base is? There's a bunch of buildings with a wall surrounding it. <laughs> when you said base, I thought you meant bait. What? What's the base Pokemon? I thought. Wait, what are you talking about? But we're not playing freaking TCG. What? Uh, ah! <laughs> I just left the battle. I couldn't even move. Rude. Ah, uh, you got ambushed. You know what? I've got the perfect move for you. Dog. We're blazing that track, mate. Yeah, you could. <laughs> <laughs> that was that was actually very well done. <laughs> that looked quite uh, funny, mate. Ah! Dog. Dog. <laughs> dog. 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 <laughs> I wish I could buy this game now and join you guys. <laughs> yeah, but, but you said you that can't... you wouldn't buy this game because of how janky and bad it is. It, it does look very. Despite the problems, it's a fun game. It just I, needs I that I think polish. you have too many expectations. The it's a Pokemon just... game. The previous it's... Pokemon game was more stable than this. Yes. They're, they're all fucking atrocious. I don't know why you expected anything better. Sun was more po stable than this. Gen 3 was peak in stability. Gen 5 was peak in content. <laughs> Even Sun was more um, stable than this. Sun and Moon. Like, even Ultra yeah. Sun and Ultra Moon. I was tempted to get Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. I haven't really had, like, any problems regarding stability. There's been the occasional graphical fuck-up, but that's about it. Yeah, I mean, like, the frame rate is quite choppy. That could easily be sorted. Yeah, but that's online, though. No, it's normal in normal no, gameplay as well. 
Yeah, but it's especially bad online. Oh yeah, definitely. Uh, I've also had like what one game crash, I think. You also I've, had three I've had no, Yeah, I've had no game crashes. I've had the occasional frame rate drops. But I assume that's because I'm playing on Switch and it's like well, that's the thing though. I've played other games that have way more stuff going on, on the screen at better resolution, at better frame rate, and yet they're made by developers that don't have the budget Pokemon does. And yet, yeah, they're yeah. probably made by competent developers though. That is true. I mean, like you see, yeah. any of the <laughs> games yes. they're humongous. So you know, I will return later when it's time for the Young Master's piano. Till then, please give him my regards. Oh, what he still actually does his lessons. Then you why are we here kicking their asses? <laughs> I'll pan the screen. You can see, watch me playing Breath of the Wild. Well, but who might you be, young man? A friend of the young master, perhaps? Uh, I'm not sure. Who is he? <laughs> ah, I see. Since you seem unaware, I must inform you that this is the base of Team Star's fairy crew, the Rockba Squad, led by young master Ortega. Uh, Mr. Harrington, I don't think we're supposed to be giving out that information. As a bee! As a bee. queen bee! Oh yeah, Vespa oh, Quinn, catch that. It's it's a bee in a skirt. <laughs> <laughs> They're quite oh, yeah, hard you... to get, catch that. Yeah, you're like um, you're like the bees, because you actually keep your own bees, don't you, Alex? <laughs> he can make Pokemon mead. Yes. He's he's his own like <laughs> beekeeper at home. This is quite quite nice. I think you I think you like like the bee Pokemon. I already oh, murdered yeah. it. Please accept <laughs> my apologies. Doesn't Vespa Quinn have an Omega Revolution or something? I believe. Nope. No. Does now? Nope. I can't. Nope. No, ma no Gigantamax. Max. Um... Do you have any oh. idea as to who this young man might be? He's no friend of ours, you know. I think he might be here to try and take us off. Understood. In that case, I take it you're an adversary of the other monster. I guess that yep. follows. Is that so? Well, then it leaves me with one last thing to ask you. Would you be so kind as to indulge me in a quick battle? Uh, sure. <laughs> I guess. Splendid, then. Let us begin. Okay, we're fighting a... So, we're supposed to be breaking into these to take them down so they can go back to school. Meanwhile, they're actually getting lessons from a teacher, and yet we're fighting them to get in. <laughs> yep. What's going on here? Makes, it makes sense, doesn't it? It's a bit of a spoiler, but would you like to hear something funny that happened to me a bit later on in the game? Eh, yeah, go on then, if it's funny. Uh, the uh, director beat me up and stole my lunch money. <laughs> <laughs> you actually lost to him. Yeah. Oh well, I guess that. Well, we've still got one base left to go, so you know. Uh, I'm gonna do double edge. I, I I'm suffering that. from the torment. Take that, you wimp! Oh really god, to... more grim, more like more grim. I really ought to uh, try and go back Media to the Kingdom. Have you not finished it yet? No. She stopped for a while. I stopped for a while well, because issues. I was having issues. Uh, then she went on to Everland and blitzed that. <laughs> yeah. I wanted to I finish tried it. I tried to Everland. play it, but I couldn't play it. You could get on with Everland. Sean would no, like go no, mad. No, no, no. Oh, here's the Kingdom. Here's the Kingdom. Really? I thought you beat it. No. Oh. I've, done that. I've done anything else this time. He got burnt out on it. Yeah, I think we yeah. all got burnt out on it. it I didn't too... get burnt out. I got too many other games I wanted to play. Like It was too it. it was too overhyped, really, I think. Well, of course and it is. It's the next big another... Zelda game. They're always a big event. Yeah, every Zelda game is overhyped. Specifically by you. <laughs> and I'm standing what, before Yeah, Sean. <laughs> but no. He, de he, he did say he you. Not me. I wasn't as hyped as Sean was. No, I didn't go on about it all the time. I wasn't watching all these theory videos. <laughs> you kept showing them to me. <laughs> uh, however, maybe a young master Ortega's battle prowess above us surpasses my poultry skills. You do well to take care. Now, if you'll excuse me. Hasta la vista. That was a brand that's in the background. Oh, whoops. <laughs> The gentlemanly guy used to be the director of the academy, I think. At least that's what I heard. But, well, we've got a different director now. Now he's, like, tutoring the boss or something. He shows up here sometimes to take the boss to his lessons. Hang on, why am I explaining this to you? There's no doubt in here you're here to make trouble. So I've got to let everyone know. Has la vista. 
Look at the bee. <laughs> why, why are you fighting with all these bees? He's so it's happy. A bee. oh, I, I, I think you'll love Beedrill, actually. I Yeah, it's Gen 1. I know what Beedrill is. No, oh, I keep forgetting. You were playing Red the other time. See, the guard's been dealt with. Good job. Their base belongs to Team Star's fairy crew, the Rough Bass Squad. Their boss, Ortega, is the mechanic of the team. Maybe the... Why are you saying mechanic? This is a fairy base. Maybe the youngest of the bosses, but his battle skills are no joke. Underestimate him, and things will go south for you quickly. He's also a real lead-from-the-back type. He gets his grunts to all the dirty work for you. But his weak point is his short fuse. Get him good and angry, and he'll march out for the front lines, deal you himself. I've got to piss him off, got it. Yeah. In terms of tactics, there's nothing else but to take down one of the lackeys. He said, yeah, well, it's just the same thing, isn't it? Do a little bit of Pokemon Dynasty Warriors and lure him out. Yeah, that's the Pokemon Dynasty Warriors. <laughs> <laughs> it's the best way to describe it, in my opinion. <laughs> Time Alex, to didn't you wipe the, the rock bar squad off to... the map. Didn't you just say to me the other day, like Alex, that you said you wanted to have a go at Whole Warriors, right? I would, yes, because it is basically which... just Dynasty Warriors. Tingle, best one? character. <laughs> and Dynasty Warriors is very much my jam. Which, which one? D definitive, which one? I, definitive, I would assume, because it will run better. <laughs> I I have absolutely no idea what the difference between no, them is. So one's based We're... off of Breath of the Wild, the other one is like throughout the entire uh, series history. Which, if you want to play as Tingle, you want to play Definitive. Who uh, the fuck is Tingle? Oh, you'll love him, I swear. No, he's not gonna <laughs> like Tingle. He only he appears in two Zelda games. No, he doesn't. And what else does he appear in? All Call of Ages and Seasons. Mm hmm. There was another one he appears in. And uh, Minish Cap, Sean. Yeah, you're right, Minish Cap. Wind Waker. Yep. Yeah. Right, uh, wait. Majora's Mask is first, then he's... Wind Waker. Sure Minish Cap. Is. Wind Waker. Oracle Seasons and Ages. I don't have Steel, so I guess I'll have to go with Chonky as my third. Get on the horse, Link. Right. Yep, we'll see how that goes. Oh, look how it's already in there. <laughs> wow. Can I? Can I? Yes. <laughs> oh, there we go. Oh, damn it. I ran into a fucking leaf thingy. I'm going in. Oh, look. Look who's here already. Clive. Clive. I keep, I keep running into Pokemon I haven't seen before. Go ahead, go ahead. I'm pretty sure the staff I all think work. That's the whole point. Ever get into position to defend the boss with all you've got? I rest assured, Intruder, you'll be dealt with. So, unless you manage to defeat Vinny, yeah, whatever. Yeah, hey, whatever. <laughs> Yeah, you know the drill, guys. I'm not going to say this every time. Three, two, one, yeah. Right, I have a feeling I might want to just run straight to um the uh, that lighthouse just to unlock that as a flight spot. Can we do that during this? Yeah. All right, I'm going to go do that then real quick. <laughs> Dodge everything. we got ten minutes. It's fine. I am Mikkel's fairy. I forgot about that. Smack everything. <laughs> Alex caught a flow it. <laughs> Chunky defeated a Florgus. <laughs> oh, Florgus. It's Florgus. Can I get all my Pokemon? No, I, I think that's, that's not. I should be. Oh, I, I can't I see. How you Gorgeous Florgus. I think it's because that we're in an event where it's like loaded like a bunch of Pokemon. So. Oh, you're being oh, fucking oh, leaveable. Oh, also be honey. Oh, no, there you are. Oh, you can see us. Yep. We... Oh no, you can't see me. Excuse me. Oh, I can't get over it. Damn it. Okay. You can't see me. We can't I get can... up. I can run you over as much as I like and you can't see it. Yeah, I don't know if you're doing it to me or not at the moment. Uh, <laughs> what are you doing? He's running us over, but we can't see him because we're uh, in an event. Uh. Dog attack. Oh, I can see you? a dog, but I can't see you. You can see my dog. I can see your dog. <laughs> I can see his dog. <laughs> <laughs> Alex, where are you? <laughs> I'm running oh, with his God. dog. Come here, you. Oh, my dog. <laughs> <laughs> it's following me, actually. Yes. What the hell? <laughs> yes, my dog. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Come along, dog. We need to run a short over. Rude. Come on. I'm fighting a bunch dog? of Mimikus. Oh, I didn't know. I lost what it. What have you named yeah. your dog? dog? Toby. Just... Toby. Toby. You did name it Toby. I was thinking that you might have done. Dog, 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 dog. 
Poor Toby. Dog. But I just needed to knock out the Pokemon because I tried to go into the uh, the woof, lighthouse, woof. but it wouldn't let me. Woof. 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 Something about that's what That's what I thought you were. You named, named it Toby for in his memory. I might have to Poor, turn you up Poor Toby. <laughs> me? Woof. I haven't done shit, mate. You've gotten quiet. My yeah, it is, it is 10 o'clock, John. Alright. 10 o'clock in the evening. Where are all the mushrooms? What? Where is the blacksmith? In Tears the Kingdom, her Taino village is full of mushrooms in it. Yeah. In it. In it. In it, it just. So, it there we go. So, Did it. It looks so unnatural now. It took me a little bit longer to do that because, again, I went to the uh, the, the lighthouse. What? Oh, oh you, this is you. I defense to the priest. It's all up to the boss now. The boss <laughs> stiff? Ooh, and no. We're all yawning. It's fabulous! Look at it! Is fabulous! Vomitos! <laughs> Ortega. So you're sure? Okay. And Panda, it seems. Talk Thank about you. underwhelming. I was expecting someone, I don't know. A bit more beefed up. Ah, oh, whatever. I don't care who you are. Not like I'm going to lose to you anyway. You think fairy types are all about cuteness? You're in for a nasty surprise. Yeah, because we've got these demons and imps to fight as well. Yeah. We should make demon type. Tiger of Team Star. In luxury balls. Here we go. Oh, ah! that's. I have a dog. Woof. <laughs> 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 He's just running about! <laughs> I'm going to play nice, but Woof. don't blame me when the battle sent you blubbering back home. <laughs> He's doing spins! <laughs> spin, doggo, spin! Woof. Spin with me, doggo! Spin! Woof. Lucario. Spin with me, woof. You know, I think I should actually do that Pokemon X um, that Stella gave me. Oh yeah, do it. Do it Stella! Do it. Stella! Do it. Hang on, I've got it. Hang on, give me a sec. I need to bring up. We're just having all the sounds today. Hang on, where is it? Stella! Yep. <laughs> I love that. Of course you do. That's from Over the Hedge, ah. by the way. If you want to watch that film again. Oopsie, that was a great, did you realise how outmatched you are? If you're going to give up, now's the time. Just I'm not much at all. Full of yourself. We're going to be in town. Soon we're going to be full with leftovers. <laughs> Good turn. There we go. That's the Azuma all done. Or oh, should I say Azuma? Do you Azuma? Azuma. Azuma. Meryl. Wigglytuff. Uh... Ah, oh, I just did that to oh. Yeah, I'm going to swap the Shion and then we can uh, use Poison Jab. I'm glad I learnt that. I found that in that little cave. There's just Animus. halfway up the mountain wall. That was well hidden. Oh, ow! Because I didn't actually have much to counter pure fairy types. Poison jab. Stab. Poison jab. Poison jab. There we go. Oh you come bad. on! You live on one, uh, really. Actually, saying saying it like I know that. You're buff, actually, but still. Saying it like that reminds me of um, what was his name? Um. Something Joe uh, from Kirby. Yeah, uh, Kirby Rob Catcher, which I recently watched the entire, entire hundred episodes again. Actually, I noticed that uh, the first fifty episodes I've already seen, but the last fifty I never really remember watching. I That's thought, because oh. it went up to about fifty-six on the Kirby channel, and then they didn't put any others up for some reason. So I watched on my favorite anime chat, anime uh, website. That actually, oh. Okay, there's new episodes I'm watching for the first time. Okay, this is good. Stab. What's that saying, Dab? Oh, good, it's so tired. I didn't dab. I didn't, I didn't dab. Poison I'm dab. tired. Oh, actually, I poisoned it, so I think poison jab. No, I'm thinking of uh, Venom Shock or something. Oh, well, I'll just do it again anyway, it will knock it out. Maybe do eyes. You're lowering my attack, how rude. Stab. Yeah, I actually lived because of that, but the poison will work it out. 
Oh god. You tried wow. to weaken me, but it was in failure. Let's go. Reverend. Well, it says it's sent out Reverend, but it's standing on it already. What the heck? Why is my team on the ropes? That's totally not fair. He says smiling and not even blinking. <laughs> well, he was blinking. He didn't furrow an eyebrow or anything. Yep, poison jab again. We'll just keep jabbing. Shion's coming in so clutch. Like, it was the underdog of the team, but then it's, like, pulled through so well and can, like, learn almost everything that I've been wanting to teach it. First so player. Uh, I'm so glad that this got sorted. Did, even if the evolution was marred by the game just being janky and not clear and then tricking us, thinking that it kind of bugged out trying to evolve when we were just doing it wrong. Like, since it has evolved, it's just been hype after that. Oh, yeah. My armor was just good. Magical talk. Alright. I'm just living. I didn't even hit myself with confusion. So, Shion is got... on point. She's focused. I snapped out of it straight away. You know what? I'm going to give a bit of blade so I can get a bit of health back. I've been having like three dots in front of me. My screen. Vikings dogs are all on my screen. <laughs> yeah. Yep. There we are. Yep. I was doing like similar damage even though it's not oh, super effective. Oh, where's this furnace? Okay. I'm trying to light the torches in the Hateno oh. and I can't find this phone. Ah. I'm too used to the Tears of the Kingdom where it's not there. Snapped oh, out of confusion God. again. I still haven't hit myself in confusion once. This is great. Yeah, that's saying super effective, but it's not doing as much damage as. It's level 50. Yeah, well, I'm level, level 50. 50. Yeah, yeah, but it's also why. a massive fuck off car thing. <laughs> yeah, I know. Aim hey, to seat yourself. No, I haven't. Oh, yeah, I haven't. I still haven't. Shion is just laser Why are you focused. trying to poison a cop? But it's fairy types. It's super effective. Oh my god. Wow. Jesus Christ. I told you, Shion's on the ball. Here's him. One more hit, and it's done. If it doesn't... Oh, my god. Seven more. Why? Now you have. The odds have been beaten! Oh, come on! I uh, thought I actually did hit there. Yourself. Damn it. That was so close. Oh! Step out, Shion. Yeah! Step out. Yeah. Yes! Shion solo! Bit too happy there, I think. Well, I haven't had a, a, an epic solo like that, which was down to the wire. <laughs> she, did, she did good. I mean, even if it got knocked out, I would just said something else out and went back. But it soloed. And only hit it so with confusion once, and it was at the very end where it would have knocked it out. And still lived. <laughs> yeah! How could I lose? What the heck? Flashback! Flashback! About a hot year and a half ago. Ah, what the heck? Your toy car didn't budge an inch, huh? Told you, it's not a toy. It's called the Starmobile. I was up all night building it. Problem's clear. We're not giving it enough juice. You, you designed got a car this thing. In a night. You got designed this thing to be powered by two Char Cadet. Who the just fuck is this kid? Oh, who, who, what, this guy? I'm talking this, about? this small child built a car in one night. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Such a shame. I wanted to see the looks of our bullies' faces we got once it got moving. Oh, wait, no, I think that was the. Yeah, we don't have. Hang on, Holy, <laughs> oh, <yeah>. Holy Magaleon! <laughs> Holy Melancholy! <laughs> what? It, it just said Melancholy on the screen. Uh, well, no, it's such uh, a remarkable if I, if I contraction. It's th here. thine own hand. Genius, my name is Autica. Yeah, well, there's no point if it doesn't work, is there? If I knew that effort would have zero payout, I'd have just asked Mother to buy a car for us. See, that's why people don't take you seriously. You say some stupid things, you know that? I love it when... Yep. <laughs> well, he's not here, I'm afraid. 
No, no, call it, would you? Yeah, how about no? I mean, we even put this in the code for crying out loud. When we started Team Star, we swore to quit relying on our parents for bags of cash to fix our problems for us. What did you forget? If that hunk of junk doesn't move, get it moving. With salt and juice, we've got to crank up the power somehow. Doesn't take a genius, man. It's easy for you to say, Melly. Do you have an actual plan? Yep, I'm going to train my child cadet and have him evolve. It boosted firepower will get the Starmobile moving no sweat. But the hour of Operation Star is nigh at hand. Will you succeed in time? Oh, I'll get it done. Yeah, she was the first one that we fought. She gave us trouble. <laughs> we almost went yeah. out of healing items at that point. You, you know, Mello shoots uh, her mouth an awful lot, but she means well. I know. Yeah, this sucks. This sucks. I hate myself for losing, but I also can't get over how awesome you were in that battle. If any of us squad bosses are defeated, that means we have to step down. Going against our code will make me a traitor to the team. Yeah, but if you step down, you're no longer part of the team anyway, so... Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> ah, fine. Not like I have a choice anyway. So take the badge already. You better treat it with the respect it deserves. There we <laughs> go. <laughs> Uh, Neutral shake. Not done yet. Here's my favourite TM2. Feel free to marvel at how warm it is. Dazzling gleam. Nice. I want to know who can learn that. Just so you know, you are the worst. Like the most annoying person ever. You were smiling when we shook hands. Rude. <laughs> but I get it. You're super strong. I'll admit that much. You even busted up my Starmobile. Young Monster Ortega. Mr. Harrington. This is time for my piano lesson. As it happens, I just lost my boss title, so I'm all good to head on home. Oh, actually, a different matter brought me. But someone I would like you to meet. Five! <laughs> He's a distant acquaintance of mine. The name's Clive. Most elegant. Okay, <laughs> what's your business here? Well, I've got all the damn voices here. I want you to tell yeah. me something. You're the son of a wealthy family and heir to a major apparel company. So why join a group like Team Star? What a question to ask someone you've just met. Well, my aunt's the same as everyone else in the team. It's because I was being bullied. Yep, school has a bullying problem, and I don't know what to do. Yeah. So the academy really did use, used to have an issue with bullying. Used to? I think you still have the problem since you're cleaning it up. But who would guess, right? The school was all rainbows and butterflies these days. And the bullies from back then don't even go to the academy anymore. Why? What happened? What do you mean, what happened to them? They've been in these bases hiding out. <laughs> you know this. How is this a question? As the former director of the academy, I believe I'm best positioned to answer that question. Mr. Harrington. About 18 months ago, the members of Team Star confronted the students who used to bully them, and an altercation broke out between the groups. Though it did not escalate into a major incident, the altercation nonetheless caused a scandal worth... Um... What is that word? Hit... <laughs> I've never heard it's, of that word, and I have a B in English. Uh, Hiverto unknown proportion. It's like, um, uh, previously. Oh, uh, okay. A scandal with previous unknown proportions. Previously, yeah. Uh, yeah. It is not basic reading. I mean, it's quite a common word. You say that, that's the first time I've seen that word. Really? <laughs> yes. Yeah. No joke. <laughs> As a result of what occurred that day, the students who had perpetrated maybe, the bullying... Maybe I read more books than you do. Maybe. I, don't, I, I honestly don't read a lot of them. But, but there aren't any records of that anywhere in the Academy. Most unelegant. No, I would imagine not. My former deputy deleted all the records of the incident, you see. Ah! Mask in your paper trail so you have a squeaky clean record, rude. Why would anyone do that? Just as I was puzzling over how best to deal with Team Star in the aftermath of the incident, this student okay. declared that they would take all the responsibility for the team's actions. In exchange, Harrington, they... In exchange, they requested that uh, I exonate the other students team staff from any blame. No, no one told me that. I accepted the request and agreed not to take disciplinary action against team staff. Then I assigned 18 months of overseas study to the student who took responsibility for the team. A year and a half of studying abroad. It was not intended as a punishment, you understand. Team staff were the victims. I wanted this student to take some time to rest, so I had them return home to the Galar region. Galar region? Okay. Under the pretext of overseas study. Around that time, however, the former deputy 
director took upon himself to raise all traces of the incident from the academy servers. It appears his intent was to shield himself from any blame. So we try to cover up the whole thing? That's terrible. After we discovered what had to be done, I dealt with him appropriately. But the inability of myself and the rest of the teaching staff to prevent this terrible act also represented a grave blunder on our part. I accepted the blame that me lay at my feet and resigned from my position as director. Ah, so you knew there was a problem, you knew that the records were deleted, and instead of sorting it out, you quote-unquote accepted the blame, but then quit so you didn't have to deal with it anymore. Highly mm -hmm. sus. The rest of the teaching staff then join me in handling in their notices. Oh, so the whole faculty quit the job mm -hmm. and didn't deal with it after covering it all up. So the reason why we're dealing with this now is because that they just saw a bunch of renegade students with no records and they were going to be dropped because they have no records because it's like they've never been to the school. And now we're just slapping them up when they're the victims. So we're the bad guy here. That's good. So that's why the current teachers were all brought in a year and a half ago. You've never questioned that. Like, every, the whole faculty restarted. No one questioned it. Uh, understand my accents have caused you a great deal of trouble. You have my sincere apologies. Hang on, Mr. Harrington. How come you suddenly decided to talk about this now? Yeah, exactly. Team Star cannot carry, cannot, cannot carry on its current fashion. I merely wish to give you a chance to chart a better course. Oh, there's no way I'm abandoning my friends to going to school without them. After we come this far, mate, you've just handed in your notice. Because <laughs> I beat you. <laughs> You're not part of the team anymore. It's because you know the your greatest treasure in the whole world. I mean, <laughs> you've lost that now, I'm afraid. Yeah, we're the bad guy. There's no question. <laughs> well, oh, okay. <laughs> Thought the game bugged on the camera for a second there. Sure, it's me. Panda. You getting this message as well? Mm -hmm. Sorry, I keep forgetting. I take that Orto uh, Ortega handed over his star badge to you then. Yes. I see. If it's boss no longer around, the Rachbach squad is as good as finished. Even Ortega. I'm sorry. We're almost there now, just one boss left. The operation's been a huge success thanks to you, too. And Clive's also performed admirably as your support. I remember him saying that your acquaintances. Have you known each other long? Eh, not that all that long. Well, he's clearly a reliable friend. Really now. He almost reminds yeah. me of the gang back in the day. Which gang? Spill the beans. As you know, Team Star was formed by a group of students who were being bullied at school. Shortly after forming the team, these students, none other than the squad boss themselves, confronted their bullies head on. The outcome was a resounding victory for Team Star, though you could already, hardly call it a contest. The bullies didn't even put up a fight. They all bolted from battle the first chance they got. Scared spitless of Team Star, the bullies then dropped out of school, one after another. And Team Star ended up the villains of the story. Yeah, and now we're taking them down, making them even worse. But that's neither here nor there. Forget I mentioned it. But how?! <laughs> Now we're just getting broke with hush money. What was that question mark in the background there? It's probably Alex. Hello. Are you outside of the walls yeah. of the base, mate? Hello. <laughs> I still don't see you. What, what? Sorry, what's going on? There, was, there there's a question mark in the background. Yeah. Pop in there. Yeah, that's definitely him. <laughs> oh. God damn it. That's, that's hilarious. I am here. <laughs> Make good use of those TMs. They should help you take down the last remaining boss. My supply unit rep will be along soon to give you your bonus reward. Which I think is the same person. Penny! Alex, keep doing it. It's funny. Well, I can't see it now. Well, here I am. A GS! Ah, stay in your Pokeball for once, will you? Licky, licky. I wish Alex had a capture card. He could show me his don't. gameplay. You see, Penny, if you didn't scream every time at um, Maridon and Coridon give you a lick, you wouldn't keep doing it. <laughs> Well, Team Star went through all that. They just wanted the bullies to go away, but then they became the bad guys in everyone's eyes. What a joke. These students, the teachers, they're all so messed up. I know, right? We're caught in politics in a Pokemon game. <laughs> School politics. And even just one of them had been paying attention when everyone was getting bullied. Well, they, yeah, they deleted the records. <laughs> they wouldn't have been able to tell right away that Team Star wasn't the one in the wrong. 
I guess the big boss was the one who urged everybody to face the bullies, despite knowing how messed up the academy is. What a massive idiot creep team star, just hoping their plan would miraculously work out. I don't know about that. <laughs> oh, here's your reward. Lots of Pokemon materials. Oh, now we can make some TMs for 